So as we gather here, we're here to remember, celebrate, to mourn, but also to appreciate a life that was lived and that's served our country. And one of the reasons we're here in the National Cemetery is because of that dedication. And I think of all those who are here, thousands, and there will be many more. And the freedoms which we enjoy, and I think of the grandchildren here today, ultimately maybe an extended family, of how we all can treasure our opportunities and privileges because of men like Dick and so many others. Psalm 91, it says, He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High, who abides in the shadow of the Almighty, I will say to the Lord, My refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. This is said in spite of the fact that we might not have what we would call all the organization of an institutional religion. I'm not sure about his belief, but I do know that God's providence was over him. It gave him a family. It gave him many friends. It gave him a wonderful opportunity to develop his talent and to uh, certainly enjoy life. We would pray that you would accept our thanks for Dick's life and all that uh, that life meant in the lives of so many other people, so many who are not here, but will be gathering again to think in terms of what he has done and what they might have done for him. So as we join together, we pray that your peace may be with us all and especially with this home.